My father-in-law used to build houses. He told me that the most difficult part of a job is usually starting it. But once you get going, you get going. Today, we're gonna show you how to get started using Unreal Engine. This is the how video. Let's go. First off, who are we talking about here? If you wanna get started with Unreal Engine, you can. All you need is a compatible computer and you can get going. However, if you're trying to get internal buy-in at your institution, you'll need the right information to sway the right people. I can help with that. Typically, you're looking at three types of decision makers when you are first starting out. The administration, the IT crowd, and your colleagues. Let's look at each one in detail. For starters, take the administration. They'll wanna know why they should say yes. The first thing you should highlight is the link between in-demand skills that prepare students for careers in interactive 3D and ready-made lessons that make the teaching process much easier for educators. This one is big because highlighting the reputability of the instruction is an essential first step, particularly if this is the first time that someone is hearing about tools like Unreal Engine, Fortnite Creative, or Twinmotion outside of the gaming world. The good news is there are standards-aligned lessons available for almost any content area. Next up, career connectedness. The skills involved in using Unreal Engine are 21st century skills that connect to every discipline imaginable. Don't believe me? Take a look at this list of industries being transformed by interactive 3D and Unreal Engine. Fashion, film, architecture, photography, user interface design, urban planning, project development, culinary arts, live entertainment. Now, think of all the curriculum surrounding these. The math, the science, the arts, the technology. You see where we're going with this, right? With administration, you'll need to draw a link between the how, what, and the why. All right, now let's talk about how to talk to IT specialists. You know, the backbone behind all the places we work. When working with the IT crowd, it is important to explain what you need to set up when it comes to using Unreal Engine at your institution. IT will have to help ensure everything is in order in terms of software installation and setup. It will also be important to determine if the school technology can run the software. The people on the IT team can determine this based on system requirements. Some IT leads will worry about account creation. As you may know, many schools struggle with this process and the need for signed DSAs, digital sharing agreements, before they can adopt new software. Epic Games has solutions that allow schools to install Unreal Engine and Twinmotion without the need for accounts. Their education team can help guide you through this process if you're interested. Lastly, we have our colleagues. You can tell them Epic Games has an asset marketplace, which includes both free and paid content that helps students create worlds really fast, some of which can be easily dragged and dropped. On top of the free lessons and tutorials for both teachers and students, it basically means you can build whatever you can imagine almost right away. That's it, you did it. You are ready to explain how Unreal Engine is free, accessible, and educator ready to your administration. And if you need more help, remember the education team at Epic Games is here to support you.